Anything else you remember your dad talking about? Any other stories or any other well, pieces of history? The uh, Makuchi Castle, that was said to be haunted. Mm -hmm. At least he and the boys believed it was. <laughs> <laughs> he said that the boys, uh, this was back when he was a boy too, would, would go in, they would sneak in, the door was never locked, so they would sneak in the front part of the house and uh, camp out at the bottom of the front stairs because they said they was going to see the ghost. It's a lady ghost. And they said that it was Ella. Well, Ella did, or no, they said it was Louise, Dawn's first wife. But Louise never lived there, but Ella did. So I thought, well, if it's going to be anybody, it's going to be Ella. Mm -hmm. But whether or not they saw anything, <laughs> yeah. I can't say. <laughs> sure. But they at least tried. Yeah. There's a lot of history in them houses that if people would only go and just catch a glimpse mm -hmm. of how the wealthy lived back then. Yeah. And to know that they're still here today for us to be able to do that is pretty awesome. Yeah. There's probably still a lot of people who have lived here for years and have not gone to see the castles mm -hmm. or even the caverns. Yeah. That right there is another good story. Uh, the caverns was discovered because a boy was curious about where the water was going. Yeah. Uh, something as simple as that. Now look what we have today. Yeah. Uh, they have grown so much and um, it's just something that's really pretty to see and you, you're not going to see that anywhere else. Yeah. Not, not exactly the same. So we're proud of our caverns as well. Is there anything else that you remember visiting as a, as a child? I know you mentioned the trees and stuff. But is there any other stories or anything with West Liberty that you remember going into certain shops or doing anything specific? No, we didn't have a lot of money growing up, mm -hmm. so we wouldn't have been shopping, that's yeah. for sure. <laughs> now, as a young girl, probably uh, junior high maybe, mm -hmm. we went to the, the castles and we went to Makuchi. Back at that time, the, um, the place was owned by Cameron Turner, or still had Cameron Turner's furniture in it. And Cameron, the furniture she brought was more for the houses in Florida because it was big mm -hmm. and it dwarfed our castle here in Ohio. And I thought it was scary. But when I went back and started working there in 2001, it was like it was totally different. Yeah. It was more how it was meant to be, how it was when Don lived there. Mm -hmm. So I always thought that was kind of interesting how something as simple as furniture yeah. would have an impact on what I remember there from you know that time period and the time in between. Sure.